Hey, it's Min Lu coming to you from Waikiki on vacation. In this video, you're gonna learn the two most important things you need to do to have high energy, AKA the juice, in order to achieve your goals and dreams, and most importantly, have a competitive edge over what I call the low energy masses. After you watch this video, you're going to have 150% more energy than before you started watching. And all you have to do is implement these two simple, but super important things into your daily routine. And I know that these two things really work because last year I went through a bout with low energy myself and I discovered these two things that have helped me recover all my previous energy and much, much more. So let's get started. So secret number one of high energy is what I call positive intention. And what I mean by that is every morning when you get up, you need to have the intention to have high energy. You need to demand that your body and mind give you the energy that you require, right? It's as simple as that. It's like a salesperson needs to ask a customer for the sale before the salesperson can get paid. Or it's like just going into a dark room and flipping the switch. If you don't flip that switch, the room will continue to be dark and you can't see. So what do the low energy masses do, AKA most people? Most people, they get up in the morning, they roll out of bed, they go wash their face, maybe get a cup of coffee, but they have no intention for themselves. And that's not their fault. Most people just haven't been taught to do this and because they have no intention they just go through the day with no special high energy they just have low energy and then when low energy finally hits them maybe two hours after they woke up they just accept it as their fate and they just uh, submit to it well, so what do high energy people do they tell themselves every morning and every time they get tired geez I feel fucking great I am going to have high energy today high energy people just refuse to be victimized by by low energy. Every time they feel low energy, they pump themselves up again. They tell themselves, I feel fucking great, right? I have tons of energy. I'm going to kill it today. Positive intent is not just important merely to pump yourself up. It's actually important because by declaring your intention to have high energy, you're going to take those actions and behaviors that support your energy and avoid any sort of behaviors that detract from your energy, like drinking too much alcohol, drinking too much coffee, just doing things that aren't good for you, right? That aren't good for your energy. Okay, that's the first most important thing that you must do every morning and every time you feel low energy pump yourself up with high energy. Now the second secret of high energy is what I call negative intent. So let's talk about negative intent. On the flip side of positive intent is negative intent. Just like declaring that you're going to have high energy, well the opposite of that, which is things like saying, God, I feel so tired today. I have no energy today. That's negative intent. Just like pumping yourself up with positive intent will boost your energy to a high energetic level. Doing all these things that have negative intent well, you can see how that goes. It's going to give you low energy, guaranteed. The low energy masses, which is like, literally like 99% of the people out there, they'll tell them, they tell themselves these things all the time. I feel like shit, I feel exhausted, I feel so tired today, right? And no wonder they feel tired all the time. So let's go back to that example of going into a dark room and flipping a switch. Negative intent is like going into that dark room, not flipping the switch, uh, putting on some sunglasses in it, maybe for good measure, putting a blind blindfold over that, right? How idiotic is that? Yet people do it all the time. So let's recap. Step number one, have positive intention every day to have high energy. Step number two, never ever from today on have negative intent. Never tell yourself, I feel like crap, I feel like shit. It's as simple as that. People are just so programmed to engage in this negative self-talk about themselves and their energy. So from today on, you're never ever going to engage in this negative self-talk about yourself or your energy again. Now, I just taught you the two most important mental shifts that you have to make in order to have high energy. But there's so many other mental tricks that you can use in order to have high energy, including other tricks. And if you want to learn about them, go to www.artofverbalwar.com forward slash high energy or click the link below in this description. And you're going to learn about my new comprehensive life-changing course, High Energy Badass, which will help transform you from someone
someone who is in the low energy masses into, well, a high energy badass. Okay, that's it. Please give me a like, please subscribe, and tell us in the comments below, what do you do in order to have high energy? I'd love to know. Until next time, this is Min Lu, signing off.